Hey, how's it going, guys? This is Isaiah Ramos here at this beautiful new construction house selling for $355,000. Very, very decorative, over the top house. It's amazing. Pantera stone, stucco exterior, facade, tile, stamped walkway, driveway, a huge front door. But without further ado, let's go ahead and begin this tour. Whew. Not gonna lie, guys, it is extremely hot outside. Today I'm rocking the cowboy boots with uh, whew, a flannel. And I gotta tell you, it is extremely hot, but this is the living room. This is the kitchen. Woo. Wow. Very, very beautiful. The dining area. Nice pot pillar. Gorgeous backsplash. Nice, beautiful countertop. Check this out. Get a nice hidden space for nice spices right next to the fridge. You get your nice wine rack. Very, very nice. But let's go ahead and uh, Make our way to the master suite or the master bedroom. This is the hallway that leads you to the master bedroom. This is the master bedroom. Wow. Decorative ceilings, or I guess coffered decorative ceilings. You got your nice fan, black accents all throughout. This is the full bathroom. What I like about it is that you got his side, of course, right next to the hamper. You got her side, you got a sink and a vanity station, and this is the walk-in shower. And of course, you've got the closet. Uh, as you can see, my forehead is extremely shiny right now because I am sweating up a storm. But this is the life of a realtor. You got shelving racks. You got this cubby over here. And of course, you've got a compartment inside here. Oh, I guess it's the other side. Yes, it is. A nice little hidden compartment. That's always nice to have. Thank the Lord for the working fan. Now right outside the master suite, you're gonna have the washer and dryer area. You got the dryer connection over there, washer connection over there, cabinetry, a rack shelf. And of course here is a two car garage, which I'll check out shortly. You got the guest room over here. You get a nice space over there to just put some stuff, whatever the case may be. You got your walk-in, not fully walk-in, but normal sized closet space. That seems to be the standard closet space in a lot of houses. I believe it's like about between two and three feet deep. But right. you got the sink and you got an extra space on the right side, which is good. Walk in shower and your nice little shelving. 
This is another guest room with beautiful decorative high ceilings. You got your walk-in closet. Now this one's an actual walk-in closet. That's always a plus. And then of course you've got your half ensuite restroom. That takes you outside. But we'll take a trip outside shortly after observing the last bedroom and the two car garage. <clears throat> This is, wow, the bedroom, beautiful, big window. You get a nice cubby space over here. You can put some succulents, whatever the case may be. You can get your nice closet space over there. We can go check out the two-car garage. It's currently locked, but let's check it out. So the two-car garage is painted. You do have a sprinkler system. You have your breaker and water boiler. It looks like there's a room over here. Do wonder if we can get it to open. And if we can't, we can't. But it looks to have a nice hidden compartment there. So that's pretty cool. But now, woo, I hope you guys are ready for this because look at that backyard. Holy smokes. So this is the back patio. The back patio itself is pretty large. And oh my days. That is a huge backyard. Of course, you've got your neighbors, but that is a backyard for sure. Let me know what y'all think. Thank you guys for always liking, subscribing. Know that Jesus Christ loves you. Thank you. Amen.